what is up you guys good morning um i forgot to shoot an intro to this video earlier so i'm shooting it now anyways um in today's video i'm gonna be taking you along with me we're gonna be shooting some tiktoks I'm, i actually hired somebody to take the tiktoks and who's like creative and has like editing software and knows filters and all this stuff um and do that um so for me personally there's just a big like i mean i'm down to learn all that stuff but it's like somebody who's already up to date on it and is doing it for other people i thought it'd be fun to um see what that would look like and see how these tiktoks or see someone else's like creative perspective on how on their take on like my clothing brand I don't know this is the whole thing is an experiment but i'm super excited to meet all these new people and have fun and shoot and just like be in road we're gonna be in beverly hills on rodeo drive so yeah anyway so stay tuned be like please She lives here in K-Town and um, yeah, I've. she said that she's moving and so I'm kind of curious because she doesn't like the area. So I'm kind of curious to see what this area looks like. I mean, K-Town is kind of, it is what it is. It's K-Town, but I want to see if I can help maybe recommend her another street or a different area in LA so she can get a better experience. Anywho, traffic out here is absolutely insane. I've never been up. Well, I've been up this early, but I've never had to be like on the road. And I didn't realize like, I mean, this sounds dumb, but I didn't really realize how bad a morning traffic actually is. Like, I can't believe people actually do this every day. That's nuts. Anyways, so I'll catch you guys in a second. Hey guys, so here we are in Beverly Hills, ready to start shooting. Here are some of the pieces we're gonna be shooting today. And yeah, I'm so excited to see how these TikToks are going to come out. Be sure to check us out and follow us on TikTok. Yay! Hey guys, Annette here, future Annette actually, because I am now editing editing the video. It's been like a week, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of behind on everything. But um, yeah, so my mic actually broke like right after the shoot when I was um, trying to shoot more content um, and uh, close off the video, it wasn't happening. And then I got busy. So anyways, it's been a week or two now. And actually, um, the content is now being posted on TikTok. So today's Monday, November 8th. And the first video was posted on Friday. And then the second video was posted today. And um, yeah, so basically the person who, Jeremy, who shot the TikToks, um, he's, he's posting them from his phone because I told him I want him to manage it so then I don't have to deal with stuff like that. Like, I, I kind of want to get it like, you know, like, systemized. Um, but, but, oh man, so honestly, um, it's not doing too good. Like, our first video, I think, got less than 20 views and like, I think only three people liked it and it's literally Jeremy, like, myself, um, like, actual like urban vintage account and like my sister like it's really sad um and then today it's not looking too good too good either i'm gonna be honest with you i deleted the tiktok app because i just cannot obsess over it but i'm just so nervous because i'm like oh my gosh like is this a failure you know like like even when i would post like my own little tiktoks on there for fun during quarantine i would get like at least 100 views and that's still really bad and right now we're only getting like 20 like it's really bad so anyways wish me luck but anyways i still want to also encourage you guys to just check out my tiktok check out the tiktoks let me know what you think i really want to get your opinion on it so like seriously go on there and drop a comment be like hey i'm from youtube or something because i really want to know what you guys think and i want to thank you guys um if you're still here watching 
I want to thank you for being here and like following my journey on just like trying to be like super like smart entrepreneur like systemized person because it's really hard and it's really I'm like a do-it-yourselfer so it's really hard for me to let stuff go but um yeah anyways thank you guys for watching again and I will see you guys soon bye